the season opener, the Rockies and the Arizona Diamondbacks. The defending NL champs, and we've been waiting for this moment a long time. It's good to be back. All the ingredients here tonight. Kurt Warner just threw out the first pitch. Enthusiasm in the city and the state is off the charts to see this team go out and take that next step this year. Well, the calendar says March 28th, but an October feel lingers in the Arizona air and a place that feels more and more like a baseball town once again. Making a second consecutive opening day start. He'll face a Rockies club that last year had the worst season in their history. Gallen has has dominated the Rockies in his career. Charlie Blackman and his Rockies teammates hoping to do something different. Charlie's ready in that left-hand batter's box. Blackman slices this high in the air, shallow left center. Guriel calling for it. Lourdes, boy, he's color coordinated out there tonight. That'll bring up Chris Bryant. And the Rockies need Chris Bryant to get it figured out in Colorado. 3-1, ground ball is short. It's right to Perdomo. He gloves, shuffles, and throws to first in time. And just like that, two down. Nolan Jones bats third. The cutter got in there on Jones. Gabby's under it. A 1-2-3 start in 2024 for Zach Gallen. Kyle Freeland, he has made the most opening day starts, or tied for the most opening day starts in the history of the Rockies organization. It'll be Gattel Marte to lead off for the Diamondbacks. Now the 1-0 pitch from Freeland. And he swings and shoots a base hit right back into center field. And a great start for last season's NLCS MVP. Corbin Carroll bat second. He chops it up the right side. Freeland grabs, throws, and got him. Good play by Kyle to get the speedy Carroll as Chris Bryant gave him the target to get him. Lourdes Gurriel Jr. bats third. Back from free agency in December. A new contract, three years, $42 million. He is very susceptible to the long ball. A look at second, now the 1-0. Gurriel swings, lifts one high, hits one deep. This one is long gone to left field. As I was saying, He's very susceptible to the long ball, and he got a pitch. And Guriel was all over it. <laughs> yeah, Way to start your season. Freeland last year gave up a career-high 29 home runs. Only three pitchers in the league allowed more. Speaking of homers, Walker led the team last year with 33. Here's U2 on Walker. And according to Phil Cousy, he went around. Walker can't believe it. That's the second out. New behind the plate by Elias Diaz. And for Kyle, he threw that where he wanted to. He wanted to get that ball down. It's a perfect spot when you're ahead in the count. It's to the eyes of the hitter. It's a fastball. 1-2 to Moreno is golf towards third on a big hop. Grabbed by McMahon. Scoop at first by Bryant to end the inning. 2 nothing D-backs after one. Rogers, McMahon, and Diaz. In this second inning for the Rockies against Zach Gallen. Swing and a ground ball. That one's fair down the right field line. It could be extra bases. Carroll quick to cut it off, but Rogers hustling and now sliding. It is second with a leadoff double. Two swings that a bat. Rogers was trying to take the ball the other way. The long foul ball that you called that went into the bullpen that time. Same type of pitch, fastball on the outside part of the plate, and he goes with it. So the leadoff man aboard, and now here is the left-handed hitting third baseman, Ryan McMahon. Sent to deep right center field. Thomas on the run. He's looking up, and it is off the center field wall. Rogers will score, and McMahon in his second base. An RBI double for Ryan McMahon. Back-to-back -back doubles for the Rockies. They're on the board. It's Diaz, the Rockies catcher now at the plate. Gabby will clean it up, went to the curveball, and Zach has his first strikeout. A young shortstop here for the Rockies. Got himself a big extension less than a week ago. Marte with a backhander. They've got McMahon hung up. He'll get the out. Tony Randazzo, the second base umpire, signaled safe. It was not caught on the fly. Montero stands in. Suarez has got it. Welcome to Arizona, Gino, who just saved a run with a spectacular play in third. 9-1 and 2 coming up for the Diamondbacks in the bottom of the third. Two singles and a walk. They're loaded for Guriel with no outs. Guriel, base hit. Perdomo's home. They'll stop Marte, and it's 3-1. Another RBI for Lourdes. Here is Walker. He struck out his first time. Swing. This is a gap shot towards left center. Doyle can't reach it. It's off the center field ball. Two runs are in. Being held at third is Guriel. It's a two-run double for the birthday boy, Christian Walker. Catcher Gabriel Moreno. He's probably licking his chops to add to this Diamondback lead. He is swung on. It's a floater in a shallow center. That ball is down for a hit. Guriel 
will score. Walker to third. And nothing going Freeland's way. Hit of the game for the Diamondbacks. They lead 6-1. to one, And here is the power threat now. And A. Eugenio Suarez. He can put this game away. There's the first one. That's a line drive into center field. Another base hit. And it's 7-1 to one, Diamondbacks. It's a hit parade going on right now by the D-backs. Two down. Here is Alec Thomas. Alec shoots it down the right field line. Gino's on the move. Gabby's home to make it 8-1. to one. Alec Thomas with the RBI double off the left-hander. Juarez at third, Alec Thomas at second. Six runs already home. A nightmare third for Kyle Friedland on his opening day. The first time in his career he allowed seven consecutive batters to reach base. The pitch, that's a base hit in a right field. Top spin line drive that brings home Suarez. Thomas will hold it third. And the hitting parade just continues as the Rockies, they've been ambushed here in Chase Fields. Could tell Marte, he will bat. There's another one. Make it 10 to 1. Marte's 3 for 3. It's the first time in Diamondbacks franchise history they've had an eight run inning on opening day. He has already come to the plate this inning, Guriel. There's another one. What a night for Lourdes Guriel Jr. Marte's going to run through the sign. And he's in there. Guriel's knocked in five, and it's 12 to one. Everything on the barrel. They're loaded again, and this time the batter is Gabriel Moreno. That's a fair ball. He squirts it up the line. Carroll's home. Here comes Guriel. Walker into third. Moreno a two-run double, and it's 14 to one on opening night. The second base hit of the ball game to drive home a run. Molina still has not retired a batter. Eugenio Suarez. Suarez lifts the 3 2 high in the air, right center. Doyle hustling over. Plays Alexander in his major league debut. The DH is 0 for 2. I live with my parents right now. So they're all here in town? Yes. That's it. All right. Well, make sure they have a good seat because you're going to be a big leaguer tomorrow. Dude. Okay? So, yes, sir. It's a beautiful thing. Talk to Blaze. Control your at bats. Drive the ball middle of the field. Hit it hard. Here's the 3 2. That'll work. Doyle. We'll play it all the bounce. Plays Alexander as his first major league hit. And it's 16 to 1 Diamondbacks. Way to go, Blaze. Demolition of the Rockies. 16 to 1. That the Diamondbacks have just set a modern day major league record. A 14 run inning on opening day. We go to the top of the fifth inning. Diamondbacks with a 15 run advantage in their season opener against the Rockies. Two away. Swing and a miss by Jones. And the inning is over. Third strikeout of the night for Gallon. Bottom of the sixth inning. One out, runners at first and second. And this ball is hit to deep right field. Cave leaps and makes a really good catch. The old line, and when you go into a ball game, the ball's going to find you. And for Cave, he had to go back, navigate the warning track, navigate the wall back there. When's the right time to jump? All of the above, and he timed it perfectly. As we now enter the top of the ninth inning, Diamondbacks leading Colorado 16 to 1. His right hander, Luis Frias, and McMahon reaching base for the fourth time today. The pitch, ground ball to third, could be two. Suarez to Peterson, Peterson to Walker, and two. Now the pitch, ground ball to short, it's Alexander. What a debut for Alexander. He does make the final out of the ball game, and that is your winner. A historic start to the year for the defending National League champions. They take down Colorado 16-1. It was over from the moment it started.